With the PlayStation 5 coming in holiday 2020, we cannot expect some great titles to come for the PlayStation 5, the next-gen console. Indeed, there are some PlayStation exclusives that we'll surely see as sequels for the PlayStation 5. Now, this is a list that I've compiled with games you should expect for the PlayStation 5. Let's get started. Let's not start with some exclusives, but for some rumored games that might release with the PlayStation 5. The first game is Assassin's Creed Kingdom, the next Assassin's Creed that will be set in the world of the Vikings. According to the game site Kotaku, it's due out in late 2020, right alongside the release of the PlayStation 5, so we might see the next Assassin's Creed releasable on the PlayStation 5. Another game that is rumored to be released in 2020, in October actually, right alongside the release of the PlayStation 5 in, in the holidays, will be Call of Duty Black Ops 5. The first person shooter is very remote for an October 2020 release, tied with the release of the PlayStation 5 and the next Xbox. Now, of course, the shooters for the consoles are always coming, even though they are released on the PlayStation 4, they might come on the PlayStation 5 as well. So we can see the next Call of Duty, rumored to be Call of Duty Black Ops 5, released on the PlayStation 5. Another game that might be released on the PlayStation 5 will be Cyberpunk 2077. Unveiled at the E3 2019, Cyberpunk 2077 is an RPG set in the futuristic dystopian California. It's due to release in April 2020, but will likely also launch for the next-gen consoles later that year. Another title that might come for the PlayStation 5 will be The Elder Scrolls 6, which has been confirmed to be in the works, and I'm pretty sure it's gonna be released on the next-gen platforms. The next game in the hugely successful Elder Scrolls series has been in the works for years. The fourth installment Oblivion came out in 2006, while the fifth Skyrim released in 2011, meaning we will overdo a sequel. Now let's start with the exclusives. The first exclusive that I can think of released for the PlayStation 5 will be Uncharted 5. The Uncharted series is not done yet, since they are playing an event for, of adventures to Drake, for Drake to be taken part of, or maybe for his daughter, which we see in the late ending of the Uncharted 4. Now, Uncharted is a very notorious series on the PlayStation on the PlayStation consoles, known from the PlayStation 3 onwards. So, an uh, Uncharted 5 for the PlayStation 5 is highly likely to happen. Another exclusive we can see on the PlayStation 5 will be The Last of Us Part 2. For the PlayStation 3, it was great, and Naughty Dog decided to release it as a remaster for the PlayStation 4. Since the Last of Us Part 2 will be released on February 2020, it's very likely to see a remastered version for the PlayStation 5 running at 60 FPS, maybe 4K. Now another exclusive for the PlayStation will be the God of War 2. Of course, God of War from 2018 was the best game of the year and after a highly successful PS4 reboot, we can fully expect to see God of War 6 making its way to PlayStation 5, rumored for a 2020 release. And of course, it will be exclusive for the PlayStation. Another game that is exclusive for the PlayStation is Spider-Man, Marvel's Spider-Man. And it's of course gonna have a sequel, since if you've seen the ending, you know that it's gonna be a sequel for that game. So it's very likely to see Spider-Man 2, Marvel's Spider-Man 2 for the PlayStation 5, since it's an exclusive title for the PlayStation. And of course, it's gonna be full of adventurous moments with Spider-Man that will make you feel like Spider-Man once again on higher resolution, with a more detailed open world, and everything we can expect for a next-gen title. Another exclusive series for the PlayStation, it's the Infamous series. Now, Infamous Second Son, which is the latest in the series, has been released on the PlayStation 4 way back in 2014. So with PlayStation 5 coming up in holiday 2020, I'm pretty sure that Sucker Punch Studios will be indeed working for a next title in the series, maybe Infamous 3 Cult. And I'm pretty sure it's gonna be released on the PlayStation 5 for the latest engine and improvements, and with everything that the PlayStation 5 has to offer, I'm pretty sure that Infamous 3 is gonna be released on the PlayStation 5. And of course, lastly but not least, we got a new game that Rockstar has been working for the PlayStation 5. This happened a while back in January of this year, when it's been confirmed that Rockstar Games is working indeed for a PlayStation 5 title. Now, we don't know if it's exclusive, but they're surely working on the PlayStation 5 for that game, with the engine and everything. They're already developing that game for the PlayStation 5, so even if it will be an exclusive or not, we don't know yet if it's gonna be GTA 6 or maybe Bully 2 or maybe agent if this could happen but yeah rockstar games is indeed working for a new game coming of course for the playstation 5 
So this is the list I've compiled to you for the PlayStation 5 titles you should be seeing on the PlayStation 5. This has been the end of the video, I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure to leave a like on it and I'll see you on my other videos. Have a good one, fams. For my soul, so with the BS, fuck me and rap, don't you hustle me as zone. The whole game is off, use me as zone.